to my wonderful artistic family. I want to say thank you to you guys for all your love and support over the years from the people who've been with me for a while and the new people who have recently subscribed. I'm so thrilled that you guys are inspired and love my abstract painting. I'm getting wonderful feedback from my different platforms and I really appreciate it. I paint from the heart. I paint with passion and uh, it means a lot to me. So this painting is for anyone, but it's extremely simplistic for beginners. Fall is here. I've already kind of got really deep into my fall colors that I love those warm, rich tones. And we're back with them again today. I'm not going to bother going over all of them. The details will be down in the description. But I just have a two inch flat brush, a new kind of one inch flat brush. I love when they're new. They don't look new for long, but I love um, using them for the first time. I have my beautiful kind of new tools I've been using for the last few months. I cut this one in half because I've got a large one. They're like these plastic Bondo scrapers for going in and doing detailed work. Um, not for painting, but you can use whatever tool you want for painting. I also have my graphite pencil to go in and do some scribbling, which is what I also use as my warm up when I'm doing this type of abstract. Um, but when I don't use a pencil, oftentimes I will just play around for the first few minutes on the canvas, moving around paint, looking for new patterns and designs. And that kind of creates the mood for me. And then the brain just starts taking over. So it's a very good practice to do when you are, it may not make sense to you when you're doing it and you don't be specific with your scribbles. You can if you want, but for the most part, you just kind of let the pencil take you. Um, and, and I use it into a certain general direction. And then I'm also using up the last of my uh, paint pens, metallic paint pens. So my gold is gone, my black is pretty well gone, and I wanted to use the silver today. So I'm really excited to get going. All of the paints are going to be fluid. I love my fluid art. I love my abstract painting. I can't compare the two. They're so very different. Um, and I love the challenges of abstract painting. Um, and also how it makes me feel while I'm creating. So it's, it's a really whole different process. So what we're going to do is we're going to go in first just with the paint pens. And uh, I'm just going to start off here. Okay. And like I said, I'm, I'm, I, I don't have a design in my head. Okay. I don't have a design. I'm just kind of rolling the pen and letting it do its thing. I'm not worried about perfectly straight lines. Um, you can, I'm not. So I'm so excited right now for this part. It's like my favorite part when I'm using uh, fluid paint on a canvas. <laughs> yeah, we'll start with you first. Look at that. Like that's just magic. Like that is just, absolute magic oh yeah yes 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 and this is just like again i'm using my scribbles as kind of like a guideline but i don't like stick to them to the t um i know when i first started abstract painting for me I was extremely rigid and the whole point of abstract painting or being creative is just that and so if you're whole if you're if you're too rigid and stuck in the box um, that's exactly what it does it keeps you in a box and it stuns for me uh, your create creativity and so I just find it really important to not um, focus too much.
so much for joining me today, guys. I absolutely love this set. Gorgeous, very cohesive, yet each one is very different, which is what I wanted. I love all the aspects of the patterns that you can see throughout, including the scribbling, um, the paint pens. You guys know the shimmer is an automatic for me. Um, I just really love uh, the blocks of color and uh, scraping and smudging paint this way. Again, very therapeutic. It makes me happy. Um, I most often love the Ocom and uh, the acrylic ink is just amazing. This acrylic ink is amazing. So these are gonna go in a silver or black frame that you will see at the end. Thank you so much for joining me. If you are still here, please like. I appreciate it, share, subscribe, and definitely comment. It helps the channel grow. It pushes the video to more people who want to learn and be inspired like you guys. And uh, again, I really appreciate it. I put a lot of effort into my videos and into my work, and it is free. So stay safe, stay healthy, and until next time, I will see you all in the next pour or painting.